Hey everybody, we are two boys. One brain cell. I'm Chuck. I'm Joel. And today we're reacting to some Green Day. Yeah. This is Carpe Diem. Carpe Diem. Um, off of their Uno album. Now, I did mm -hmm. listen to this album way back um, when it came out, I want to say. Yeah. Back in 2012? I, I believe it was Uno. Yeah. When it came <laughs> out in 2012. I listened to it. I don't even remember if I made it halfway through this album. Do they have it? It's in the first album? three songs. Do they have an album called Trace? Yes. There's three albums. They got Uno, Uno Dose, Dose Trace. Trace. Yeah. That's fantastic. Right there, Trey. And they all came out in 2012. Yep. They came all out once. That's why I said I can't remember if it was this album that I listened to. It was one of those three that I listened to. I want to say it was Uno, but I could be wrong. Um, and I just could not get into the sound. So I... Never picked it back up after that. So this could uh, potentially, I have heard it. I doubt I remember. But just to be completely upfront with y'all. Yeah, um, there's a good chance that I have not. Yeah, you heard you the older stuff, I'm sure. but Because, you know. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's jump in. Yeah. And did you already add this to Patreon for, uh, pick for Jack? I have not. Hey, what up, Jack? Thank you. Thanks, Jack. Appreciate you. Let's, uh, let's send this. Yeah. What you thinking, bud? I really, really enjoy the rhythm 
of the chorus. Yeah. Um, I will say outside of that, this song felt very average to me. Okay. It, it was, but, but the, the chorus definitely stood out like a lot, but outside of that, it just felt like, okay. All right. So here's what I got. <clears throat> Reminds me a little bit harsher than yours. Okay. So the chorus is the best part of the song. Agreed. Fully. And even there, it's I. Right. The rest of the song feels very lifeless and like he's singing with absolutely no passion. The whole song feels really passionless, honestly. I like the instrumental throughout the other parts. It has a but rhythm. I can agree with you when it comes to the vocals there. It has a really rhythm, but there's nothing peppy there to keep yep. me I agree wanting to come back to this song. Like, it just very kind of like, here it is. The whole three minutes and 25 seconds is very just kind of linear and nothing real exciting happens during no the song. Pop. There's nothing that pops. He's not singing with really any passion in it. Um. Yeah, this it comes off as almost generic for Green Day for me. I would say. Yeah, like I said, I really like the rhythm there. That's the chorus. Part. I I can agree that um, I like the chorus and the rhythm of the whole song. It didn't make me upset, but it right. also didn't do anything for me because it just wasn't very yeah. much energy there. Yeah, like I said, the rest of the song to me just felt very average. Just like I even that. put myself in a position like, oh, if I was seeing this live. I feel like I'd just be bobbing yeah, just swaying be so, around. That's about it. Yeah. I feel like the crowd wouldn't really get into this overall. This is that's what I'm saying. along with the chorus, but that's about it. it. This song would remind me of like if you're watching a live, like a smaller band that has not got their rhythm down yet, mm -hmm. and they're playing an entire album because that's what they have to play. Yeah. And then you your first like six songs, people are like, before, right. you, get, before <laughs> you get to some songs that are a little more decent. <laughs> yeah. Now, mind you, that's been my, uh, like this song in and of itself. Um, with the very average appeal with that, the chorus rhythm that really kind of bumps it up just slightly above average. Mm -hmm. That's my overall, overall, that's what I think Green Day, think when I think of Green Day, okay. just because of, they have their hits. But they definitely have their they, hits. They, they got their big ones, but overall the rest of their music to me that I've heard has been much like this. Yeah, I, I, I have to agree with you on that. Like Green Day, I... I don't like doing this with bands where I pin them down to they were only good in their old stuff. But for me, it, it, post 2010, I haven't found anything really has popped out. I and mean, we did a reaction a while back mm -hmm. for a song off their last album and just didn't do it for me. Um, I don't know. It's just lacking something that was there when we were younger and kids uh, like, and I still listen to that kind of music here and there. Mm -hmm. So it kind of bothersome. I'll I just don't get dive it into the old green day stuff. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. That first album's a, is a classic dookie phenomenal um and obviously after that they still didn't stop putting out hits right. definitely a little more radio oriented but they definitely had to put out their hits and um i really enjoyed that but something after know your enemy just i could i i haven't found it all feels like it's really lacking in passion and stuff i don't know yeah. you but, haven't found that hitter yeah so what's that your that total rating uh 5.3 5.3 no playlist and or playlist it's not going to be a playlist. Yeah. This isn't going to make a playlist for me either, and I'm just going to go flat five here. Yeah. I'm really confused on it. I, said, I do really like that chorus, though. Yeah, which that I almost kind of wanted to toss it in a playlist because of the rhythm there, Yeah, and I really enjoy that, but uh, I don't think it'll last. Yeah, I'm, I'm, tr I'm trying to get a little more picky with what I'm putting into the playlist yeah, I because really, it's going to be a bloated mess. Yep, and I really don't think this will last in there, so I'm just, I'm good. Yep. Well, regardless, shout out to Jack. We appreciate the yeah. uh, tune. Definitely worth a try trying to get us in some uh, newer style of Green Day. Um, yeah, 100%. Saying newer style, and it's been, what? 11 years. 10 years, 11 years, yeah. So, uh, but yeah, we appreciate that, trying to break us out of our... Uh, it's definitely out of our comfort zone, and definitely enjoy that. Um, but, yeah. It's all right. Swing and a miss. You'll have it. Yep. You'll have it. Guys, we're two boys. We have one brain cell. I'm Joel. And I'm Chuck. And uh, make sure you guys uh, drop down in the comments to get that brain cell. Whee. And smash that like button. Until next time, y'all, peace, peace out. Peace out.